here is the tail portion crudely laid out. I have not put any of the uh, Clecos in to hold it into place, but this is how the outline is going to go. So I'm going to go ahead and start Clecoing it in until it gets all held up together properly. Okay, that went together way faster than I thought it would. Everything fit perfectly the first time. Um, each rib, I just have a couple of Clecos holding it on. I have the back overhanging over here so that way I can work on the part that's uh, most prevalent right now. So I guess the next part is just to, to drill them up and, and get them ready to permanently attach them. But it's surprisingly simple this particular piece right now. I got all the holes drilled up to the 125 size and I have these drilled up as well. Now I'm going to go ahead and take it apart and uh, clean it and deburr it and get it ready for painting. I have it washed and painted and back together but before I go ahead and start riveting it I'm going to put the skin on on one side just to make sure it all fits properly and that way I can kind of make any light adjustments before I uh, fully rivet the, uh, the structure right here. All of the pilot holes line up properly on this side, which leads me to believe they'll line up properly on the other side too. One other thing I had not done yet is um, there are three holes that need to be drilled here wherever it attaches from, oh sorry, the spar coming in. So what I want to do now is flip it over and find those holes and mark them and drill them now while the, the skin is held in the proper place so that way I know that those holes will be drilled in the proper area. Yeah, and since there were no pilot holes, I need to do that uh, manually. I just found out that the pilot holes are on the inside here, so I need to drill from this side out to make sure I get a proper um, uh, hole drilled. And so I'm using my 90 degree drill angle so I can put it in there and drill those three holes. I'm using this clamp just to hold it in place until I get the first hole drilled and I can put a Clico in, then I'll continue to drill them up. Got the holes drilled, and I'm going to take the skin off and then go ahead and rivet all these parts together. Uh, I'm not going to rivet the top here just because I had to take it off last time when I um, did the, the elevator, so I, knew, I know I have to have that available for the, the fiberglass tip. So I'll wait till the end to, to drill that, but at least have these holes up here ready to go when I'm ready to uh, uh, put the fiberglass tips on. Here it is with all the rivets pulled. Uh, minus the ones on the top that I mentioned earlier. I think the next section is going to be adding uh, this little bit right here, the um, leading edge tip for that spot, and then that will ha uh, give it two places for the, the skin to attach to in the front as well. And I'll just keep working on it. Thanks for watching, guys.